For some darn reason, his, their heads are so stinking hard to get on. <laughs>
And I get to put Thanos together. Because oh. Thanos is going to be mine. What? Yes. You never agreed to this. Can we share it? We can share. He's got other people, but here he is. He's got the Avengers logo on his pants. I'm sad that it kind of didn't come with like these, but I know he's really good. So I probably could have fit that in the packaging, but like that would have been cool if he came with like Bruce Banner and like you could like switch out the pieces oh, so like yeah, part of them was transformed cool. into the whole and part of him was Anyways, he comes with Thanos, so I'm gonna let Mom do that. And here he is. Awesome. So you want to compare them in size? I really feel like Thanos is much bigger than the Hulk, but for some reason the Hulk is way bigger than Thanos in this series. I'm not disappointed. They're buddies. Oh no, they're not buddies. Are they fighting? He's like, hey bud, how's it going? Let's go out for a drink sometime. So we finally have Thanos put together, yay! And all of these have great articulation. Awesome. Wrist move it. Mid arm. Awesome, awesome, awesomeness. And his head will not <laughs> stay on. There we go. Thigh, knee, ankle. And, and I love his spine in the back, the back and his face. Just that, that grimacing, just. I love this. Love it. Love it. So, we did the whole series. What do you think? You like it? Mm hmm I want to get the other one because you can put together Odin. Mm-hmm. <coughs> Odin is really awesome. Okay, so we're back, and we've got our top three. So, we have top three female, top heroes. three male heroes, and then our top three villains. We did not separate them into categories of male or female. We left them just as is because we don't have a whole lot of villain favorites. Um, I know that we have our select ones that we really, really like, um, but I don't think we could really come up with more than three, so we left it like that. So I hope you guys join in and let us know what your all's top threes are. So here we go. Asha, do you want to start with your top three female? Yes. Um, so these are my top three female um, favorite heroes. And so, my favorite is probably Scarlet Witch, and my second favorite is probably Watts. My favorite is Jean Grey. Those are good favorites. So, my top three favorites, I'm going to start from three and go on up from there. So, my third favorite is Black Cat, and it was really tied between Black Cat and um, Black Widow. <laughs> <laughs> I completely forgot. Um, so Black Widow and Black Cat are kind of tied, but I chose Black Cat for my number three. My number two is Rogue, and my number one is Psylocke. And I know in the previous video, or first or second of the Marvel week, um, I had said um, Catwoman, but I wanted to just keep it strictly Marvel. So that's the reason why Psylocke is my number one on that. Uh, my top three male heroes is Spider-Man as my first, Thor as my second, and Wolverine as my third. Those are some really good ones. I really like Wolverine too. Um, so my male, I'm going to start from number three. My number three is Star-Lord. And probably before Guardians of the Galaxy, he was probably last on my list. Um, the Guardians of the Galaxy movie really um, bumped him up there for me. Um, and plus it's Chris Pratt. And number two, Doctor Strange. I have loved Doctor Strange for years. I'm super excited about this upcoming movie um, with uh, Benedict Cumberbatch as Doctor Strange. I'm kind of leery about that, but I'm going to uh, remain optimistic. And number one is Deadpool. Deadpool is my number one superhero. Or my male category. Yeah. Um, my villains, my first favorite, Loki. And my second favorite is Modoc. If you didn't know, he's the guy with the giant head floating in the chair. And then my third favorite is Mystique. Mystique is a good one, and she's also on my top three villains. So my third favorite villain is Loki, just because he's super awesome. Tom Hiddleston. Oh. Tom Hiddleston was wonderful. But Loki, I mean, he's just one of those lovable, kind of laughable characters. Um, my number two is Mystique. 
She's really, really awesome. And I really like her in these new X-Men movies. Um, and my number one, if you have not guessed, is Thanos. Just because he is super awesome. He is one of the biggest baddies that there is. Um, and I have learned so much about Thanos. And I think he's just a really cool villain. All right, so we are gonna do our fun facts and Chocolate. our Marvel Avengers assemble. Chocolate. And I have Thor. I'm gonna eat Captain America. I'm sure he tastes like a capsicle. Okay, Thor hails from an otherworldly land called Asgard. This is a good fun fact. Mm -hmm. you Trish? Guess what, it's the same one that I had in the previous video. Mm -hmm. Go check out our previous video to find out what it is. Well, we gotta tell them which one it is. <coughs> it's the one about Captain America. Uh-huh. So we're gonna go ahead and sign off. This is our last day of Girls Got a Creek Marvel Week. Bye. Thank you guys so much for watching and staying with us all week long. I hope you guys have enjoyed the movie that is going to be premiering tonight. We actually <laughs> saw it last night. Um, but we didn't want to do any spoilers, so we're not going to do that at all. But again, thank you guys for watching. Follow us on Instagram at... <laughs> I will post that down below. And we will see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. And that were... What is that? Grammar issues over here. Trace. Welcome to the Breaking News. <laughs>